Hey guys, it's Rain, and today I'm going to show you how to make the cake from Kiki's Delivery Service. So in the movie, Kiki helps this lady make a pie for her granddaughter's birthday, and in return, the lady bakes her a birthday cake. The cake looks like this, and my interpretation of it was it's just a chocolate cake with a chocolate ganache glaze and white chocolate letters for the stencil of her and the tree. So these are going to be the ingredients you will need. A box of chocolate cake mix, 8 ounces of chocolate chips, a bag of white chocolate chips, and a cup of heavy cream. Make the chocolate cake according to the directions on the box. Now bake the cake in a round cake pan. I put mine in two pans because I added a filling, but that's optional. And just put it in the oven for the amount of time it says on the box. And I just took a piece of parchment paper and traced over a picture of the cake from the movie. And it looks like this. Alright, now we're going to melt the chocolate for the stencil. And this is super easy. You just want to fill three bags with white chocolate chips, one with a lot, and then two more with like just a little bit. And you're going to need some red and green food coloring. Put the bag with the chocolate chips in a pot of hot water. And eventually it will melt like this. So after the chocolate is melted, just cut off a tip of the plastic bag and you can just pipe it onto the plate. Um, with the little bags, I just mixed in the food coloring so you can make the bow in the tree. Put the white chocolate in the freezer to set. After your cakes are done baking, just put them on a cooling rack and let them cool to room temperature. And while those are cooling, we can start making the ganache. And so all you do is heat up some heavy cream and you're going to pour it over your chocolate chips. Now let the heavy cream sit on the chocolate chips for a couple of minutes to let them melt, and then take a spoon and stir them all together until they're shiny like this. Now we're just going to pour it on top of our cake. I frosted my cake and put them together. Um, all you really need to do is just pour it on top of your cake. You don't need to frost it or anything like that. I think frosting it just makes it look a little better and gives it an extra flavor when you cut into it. And I took out the stencil from the freezer because it's all set now and I'm just putting it on top of the cake. This is what it looks like when it's done. So this is the finished cake and I think it turned out pretty good. I wish I would have done a little better on the chocolate lettering but overall I thought it was really fun to make and it looks pretty close to the movie. This is actually a collaboration video. I met another YouTuber and her name is Megan. Um, I'll leave a link to her channel right here. She actually did a really amazing version of the herring pie from Kiki's Delivery Service. So here's a picture of the one from the movie. And here's a picture of the one that she made. And it's crazy. They look really similar. She even like redid scenes for the movie, which I thought was really cute and clever. Um, I'm excited to try it out for sure. So you guys should definitely check out her channel and her video and subscribe to her and show us some love. Thank you guys so much for watching. Happy cooking. Bye.